in the green Kentish countryside is a monochrome mansion decorated entirely by doodles. The whole house, and I mean everything, has been covered in 900 litres of white paint and using 401 cans of spray paint. And the effect, well, it is absolutely unbelievable. And it's all down to this man, Sam Cox, AKA Mr. Doodle. Sam, the obvious question is, why and how have you created this masterpiece? Well, I mean, uh, it's always been a lifelong ambition of mine to get a house and just doodle all over it, doodle the inside, doodle the outside. Each one of these individual doodles are different, is that right? Yeah, uh, uh, I try and make, well, I mean, it's easier to make each one different than it is to make them the same. You've had millions of likes on social media. Why do you think people love it so much? Uh, I don't know, I mean, I guess people like, sort of thinking like wow like someone's done that to their house what a like strange thing to do to their house but um to me it feels natural sam's documented the entire painstaking process in this remarkable time-lapse video it's taken him two years and two thousand pen nibs to turn this 12-room mansion into a masterpiece upstairs the tour continues i call this room the cloud room each doodle is designed to paint a picture. This is the computer room and all the drawings in here are inspired by technology. Just when you thought there couldn't be any more, the bathroom is completely decked out in doodles too. Absolutely, there's 2,000 individual bathroom doodle tiles in here. In just a yeah. fortnight's time, Sam and his wife Alina, yeah. Mr and Mrs Doodle to their friends, will be moving in permanently. So what do you think it's going to be like living and sleeping in this all the time? Well, we, we kind of uh, are used to it. Like my old bedroom at my parents' house was all doodled and we, we lived in that and it was a doodle world. And what are the neighbours made of it? We've been quite lucky. They were very supportive. They were like, oh, we love the chimney. <laughs> we were like, thanks God, they love it. Having doodled the house, next step is the garden and possibly a whole street. This is a couple who clearly live, breathe and sleep their work. Martin Stew, ITV News.